Now we are going to paint the the, sh the shingles. The customer gave us the the paint over there. And in a few hours, I'm going to show you how everything looks like. Okay, now I'm going to show you the tools that you're going to need in order to do this uh, job. So basically, you're you're going to need uh, if you can buy the, the same thing. I mean, it will work uh, great. Is one gallon and a half gravity feed uh, texture air spray gun so if you can buy that this it works uh, great it's just at least at this time is $36 $35.99 you can get it here in Harbor Freight or if you want to get it uh, elsewhere you can do that uh, as well so this is the most economical uh, one that I was able to find if you're outside the United States you might just send you something like that just let me know all the information my information is in the video description otherwise i'll try to leave everything in the video description if you want to buy yourself because you're here in us already so um you can uh, I, I don't recommend using this uh, that you see here because uh, this type of uh, paint that you're going to buy in order to do uh, these type of jobs is very thick so you're going to clog the, the tip very often and it's going to be a pain in the butt uh, to do something like that so uh, usually at least uh, for now is 170 the paint that we use for this uh, roof and if you can see the, the people uh, they were uh, happy with this so you can see it has at least for now like uh, 70,000 uh, reviews and here you can see the, um, the the color so here i'll show you a few reviews so f f people they were painting here so you see the black here is kind of gray let's see another picture so i don't know if they did the same thing here oh, uh, barely you can notice here is a little bit darker than like here but uh, it says yep yeah, it works as you can see here so that is what I'm going to, to show you. So, so the, the only thing is that you're going to need more than you think. Uh, if you're going to buy just what uh, they say in the in their website, uh, buy double or triple. Whatever you don't use, you can return. At least here in US, is that is the way it is. So it looks uh, fine. And uh, here you have a few options. I mean, if you want to buy it uh, elsewhere, you can. Otherwise, in Home Depot, they have it. So tools that you're going to need, like I said before, you're going to need this uh, sprayer. Uh, if you use something else, you're going to have issues, like I said uh, before. And then you're going to need the um, air compressor. I've been uh, using for this job the 20 gallon, and it works uh, great. So if you want uh, something, if you have something larger than that it will work great if it's smaller uh, the compressor is going to be working all the time and it's not going to be like very efficient uh, that we can say so if you see here we go to the bottom and i think it, it was the second picture here yeah let me show you the second picture here so if you see here it says compressor requirement uh, 30 gallons plus continuous or 7 to 29 intermittent, uh, 1 to 6, not recommended. I mean, I I, I tried because uh, for this job I took uh, two helpers and uh, I had uh, the, the smaller one, one that was the very little one and the, the big one that I told you before, I took two compressor and the other one, uh, I mean, it's working like 24 seven. So I would recommend the, the other one, the 20 gallons or, or, or greater. greater. So other than that, uh, I'm going to show you a few pictures that I have here in my um, other screen. So this is uh, me here. So we were applying it uh, here. Here you can see the, the buckets. Here is my, my helper. So we started in the daylight and it took uh, several hours. So here, as you can see here, this side it was uh, darker than the other one. The guy, the only thing, the downside of this is the, um, the customer didn't buy enough paint. So we tried to spray it, you know, as much as possible. So the, before it was getting darker or we fo before we leave and I said to the customer, okay, if you want us to come back another day, we can. Um, and he said, uh, later he said, okay, yeah, we can do that. So, uh, and after, after that, uh, because the house was uh, huge, we did uh, mostly the, the side that you can see from the street because they, I think her, uh, his wife uh, didn't want to see the gray, uh, she, a shingle he uh, 
she wanted to be all black so we started working here until very uh, late at night so uh, this is the other um, a sprayer that this guy uh, had so he said okay use it uh, the uh, we tried but uh, you know like i said uh, before you can use this uh, the, the thing with this i mean it's good if you're going to paint you know with regular paint that is uh, very uh, thin but if you're going to buy some if you're going to do the shop that i told you with the thick uh, paint it's not going to work so we gave it a try because the customer want us to try but it didn't work that well we had uh, issues all the time with the compressor with air compressor it works uh, fine you don't have any issue if you buy if you buy uh, what I, I just said so here we keep uh, wor working here so uh, here we have another picture keep working here uh, i was ta uh, taking a few pictures so that way the customer can see you know everything without going to the uh, roof and uh, we had you know a few extensions uh, for the air hose that you're going to need in order to do this otherwise uh, it's going to be complicated we are not going to move the the compressor to the <laughs> to the roof so here is the the, the boxes so we bought uh, two boxes uh, we this is what we, we use and it works uh, great at least for these type of things like i said before uh, you in at least in the paint that we bought that yeah, i think it was this uh, the, the paint that we use it says you cannot you know uh, dilute it with anything um, so you have to use it the, the way it is at the end because like i said we didn't have you know much of this uh, we put some water and it worked i mean uh, to dilute it a, a little bit more because like i said in the, in the beginning uh, the customer didn't have enough uh, paint you know to cover uh, the whole uh, roof but it, that it did the, the shop so now i'm going to show you the the rest of the video that we did as usual you have to be careful when you go to the roof you know in this case the the pitch wasn't that um, bad i mean the the angle of the of the roof so it was it was okay um but it, you have to be careful depending on the roof that you have so now uh, i'll show you the the rest of the work As you can see, the customer wanted all black, so he's coming along very good. So we keep uh, we keep uh, painting, and hopefully we can finish before the sunset. Thank you. 